Raster machining is a very good strategy for finishing any part. When used in conjunction with a perpendicular pass that has been optimized, it is an ideal one button click strategy for finishing the whole part, uh, typically for softer materials such as aluminium or resin, where the cutting direction is not critically important. As you can see on the screen, with a standard raster toolpath, where the raster passes are parallel to vertical walls, the step over becomes very large as the tool is projected down onto those near vertical walls. Also, standard raster will give us a sharp corner in the toolpath if the tool radius is bigger than the part radius. But we can optimize this raster toolpath to give us a arc in the corners where we have a sharp corner and also we can introduce a parallel pass in the areas in the steep areas where the step over is very large. So the end result of using this perpendicular pass, which has been optimized um, to a shallow angle of 30 degrees in this case, is that the tool path will machine over the part completely in the one direction and then will revisit the part in the opposite direction, but only in the areas uh, where the step over was large. And you'll notice that both of these directions have been trimmed back to each other so there's no overlap of toolpath. And finally in the corner we can see the arc fitting of the sharp corners. So as a general finishing toolpath for soft materials then optimized raster is uh, an ideal strategy.